I have panties on. Yeah, no, that was just. Because what can be is unburdened by what is. Oh, <laughs> no, you didn't. Because I know there's fatties out there like me. Okay. All right. Well, yeah. All right, so we're going to start it off like this. Essentially, right? I know what you're probably saying. Jay, why would you get a bike like this? You got sent it like those other reviewers that get sent free shit. Um, no, I actually bought this. And the reason why I bought this bike is because Brie rides that thing over there. And she does ridiculous mileage. And she says, why don't you bring it on in? So Brie rides this thing. And I know what you're going to say. There's no, no way someone built like that rides a bike. Well, if I showed you how much mileage she does on that bike, I think you'd be severely shocked. <laughs> Can, are you able to show them how much mileage you do on that bike? So they get an idea that she rides. So I bought this bike. I bought this bike because I said, I'm going to ride with her. Well, my fat ass, um, you see the extra seat I got? I got this sport bike and uh, no good. It, I, I don't like it. So I said, she goes 30 miles at a time, 25 miles. I'm not gonna be able to keep up with that. Look, I'm fat, so I need to slim it down. How do I do it? Well, I kind of cheat the system. I get an electric bike. That's exactly what I bought. So I did a lot of searching and I got this guy. This is the Pace E500. And uh, it does not come assembled. So that means that I have to assemble it. I have no idea what is inside of this box, what it, inco what it comes with. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put it together. And you guys are gonna watch me do it. So for those of you that are watching this, after it's been edited, this is how many miles you got. Crazy talk. Tell them what you're working with, Brie. 30. 30 today. miles in total? Yeah, for today. Yeah, but show them, can you show total of how many miles you got? Nah. No? No, you don't think you could do that. There's no way that doesn't show the overall statistics? No? No. No, it, it, it could show months. It could show how much you've done in a month? Yeah, I think so. What is it, something like 800 miles? Oh, at least. Yeah, it's too hard to get to, but I can put it in there if I can. Okay, so if I can find um, it. what I'm going to be using to open this up, hopefully this is all that I need. I'm thinking that that bike is not, it's not going to be put together. I do have some experience with motorcycles, somewhat, and then I'm going to be using the... Uh, the abalone jam. A little haze out the front. Okay, so let's just open this up. Let's see what we got. And then again, this is the Pace 500. Aventon. I think they're out of New Jersey. Obviously, it's Chinese made. Did a lot of research. A lot of research. And then this is what we came up with. Well, not we. Me. How does it stuck? Use those guns, Brie. I ripped it. I was too strong. You're too strong? I was too strong. All right. Journey starts here. Open this flap, remove main accessory box. Remove the four white box clips marked on the bottom of the box. Oh, it's got those little, well, there's one missing. You know, when the FedEx guy brought this, um, when the FedEx guy brought this, it looks like the rear tire is already on there. When the FedEx guy brought this, he put it over his head like a crazy guy. How do you get the clips out? I don't know. Take out the accessory box from here. It's the weirdest accessory box. There's absolutely nothing in it. So, yeah, it looks like the rear tire is already on here. If you want to do the clips, it'll just fall out. We get this little accessory kit here. It looks like all of the tools are included inside of here. So that's good. Allows you to... Uh, allows you to, uh, yeah. Allows you to put it together if you don't have tools. Yep, nothing. Two boxes, nothing in it. So the clips are what, holding it holding it in? Yeah. Now it looks like one clip, it's got those super advanced clips on the bottom there. I've seen that in Sonos before. That fat ass. 
You got it? Yeah, this one's like jammed. Hold on. I don't understand what the clips are doing. <sighs> Holding the box together. Can you help? S sweetheart, look. It's not attached to anything. Can you look on the inside? Okay. Or just pop it off because it's going to make you feel better. Yep, that, you know, it, Brie, if you look on the inside, it's doing absolutely nothing. It's doing something for my brain. Okay. Ah! All right, you, you keep messing around with that. Here's the bike. <sighs> GG. So it looks like the rear brake is already on it. All we're going to have to do is put the handlebars on it. Check our tire pressure. It's got that comfortable. No, that's. Oh, it would have pulled out the whole thing. Ah. I see. So there's, there's nothing in the box. Then I we just go like this, Jay. Oh. Huh. Okay. Well, that looks nice. Let me bring this camera in a little bit. Out of the box. Uh, looks like you just kind of put that together. Simple shit. The tires are nice. Nice hydraulic discs. It's actually a nice looking bike so far. Go ahead, Bree. Take it away. You want to help? Go ahead. I see you looking, you're looking like you want to do something. Yeah. So this is the carbon black version. Wow. That's, that's your battery. Again, not the top of the line, Aventon. And again, keep in mind, I bought this. This was not sent for a review. This was me purchasing. Because I know there's fatties out there like me. Want to get on a bike, but they don't. Uh, I hope the pedals are in that box. I'm not a big fan of these little LED indicators. That's going to be your... Uh, uh, they're not super cheap, but Pace 500. I will put a link in the description. Yeah, it's not bad. Not bad thus far. It literally becomes all 99% assembled. You want to be part of it, Mama. You can be part it's of it. It's NBD. N no. No boobs. What does that mean? What? NBD is new bike day. When you get a new bike, you take a picture of it and you post it to Reddit saying NBD. And everyone goes, ooh, that's nice. It's got the same brakes. You know, if I had scissors. Scissors? If I had scissors, I'd be able to cut that a little bit better. This razor, because the bike's falling over. Why don't oh. we just untie it? You could do that. And handlebars up. Do, 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 do. What does this say? This forward left side. There you go. Look at that. Look at that. You're adorable. Look at that. Got a little <laughs> kickstand and everything. So this is uh, the medium. I'm thinking I should have got the large. Oh, you got a medium? It said 510. I'm, I'm close enough. Yeah. No? <laughs> well, with bikes, it's better to go smaller than too big. Is that what they tell you at the bike store? Yeah. Because smaller, you could always raise things up. But if it's too big, you, you can't really bring it closer than what it can. You know what I mean? Because what can be is unburdened by what is big. Oh, <laughs> no, you didn't. I don't know how to get this off. Unless we unscrew that. Right? What's inside of the box here? Trying to get an idea of everything inside of it. Looks like you get a wrench. Apparatuses. Looks like some cloth rags. Cloth. That's bike grease. Stickers. Manual. Pedals. Allen key reflectors. That is your charger. And that's it. That's everything inside of the box. My bike mount can't hold an electrical bike. It can't? No. Doesn't it hold it by here? It can't support the weight. Why not? Because it's only rated up to like 30 pounds. Oh. All right. We need grease. Who said we need grease? We have to put grease here with our finger. What are those? Keys? Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Grab some bike grease, Mama. It comes with it, yeah? Yeah. Spare parts. It's, it's almost identical to setting up an electric scooter, quite literally. Um. That is a lot of. There we go. All right. What you? Why, why are you? Why are you looking at a manual, Bree? Do you not have faith in what I could do? <laughs>
It's like petroleum jelly. Like the stuff we use in your ass? What? And there you go. And that's done just like that. But before we do that, we got to put that front tire on. So before we tighten that, we got to go like this. Yep. The black stopper they got on the forks is entirely smart too tight so putting this in is simple you line it up inside of the calipers like so make sure that your washers are on the outside so i'm gonna need to adjust those pistons gonna have to jump uh, yeah, we're going to have to adjust those calipers a little bit. Okay, so we're going to use their handy dandy wrench that it comes with. It being matte black is um, is not the best. There's a little tiny recession for your washer there. That's pretty nice. Multiple adjustments here to adjust those handlebars. There you go. So that's the piece, right? That obviously broke off. That's, uh, that's not a good design. Mine didn't do anything. No? Mm-mm. -mm. What way do you go, Mama? Tell me. Not the way that your brain says. Right, so what is it? Here you go. You I got think it? I'm gonna let you do it. Oh my goodness, woman, you are killing me. You, you done already? Before I break what? it. Why would you break it? Because, Jay, I'm mentally incapacitated. Tell the world so they know. Hello, Look. world. And there's Jay's really nice truck bike in the background. I said, debris, don't touch that. Jay's gonna beat you up. I'm gonna beat you up. That's it. Tell the world. <laughs> Why don't you be a sweetheart? Yeah. Grab that fan for me. Yeah, of course. I'm sorry. For what? Messing up your bike. You didn't mess it up. Good. You just, when you get your road bike, maybe what? I should put it together, right? Uh, uh, what? Maybe I should, although it's gonna come already together. Yeah. You know, for somebody that's gonna buy an e-bike like this, now I can't speak for anybody else, but I can speak for Aventon. It's, it's not difficult, man. Well, so online, they uh -huh. they say, they, they call people that have these on their bikes uh -huh. geeks. Geeks? Yeah, because they left those on when getting well, the bike. Well, these are reflective too on the sidewall. So in theory, yeah, they, they call people geeks if they have that on their Do you their know bikes. how these are moved? It's probably a screwdriver. I don't okay. know. You don't have to take them off. You, I'm you with just, you. I'm you, all about removing yeah. safety features. Yeah, I wanted to take mine <laughs> off, too. I'm all about removing safety features. You remove mine? Yes. So that way I'm not a geek anymore? Is that what they seriously call them? Yeah, they make fun of people. Like, if you say you got a new bike and you're all excited and you post, they, they call you a geek for having those on your bike. <laughs> Like, everyone is so, like, <laughs> well, pro-helmet and pro-lights, but if you have reflectors on your rims, they will mock you. Really? Yes. <laughs> like, you have to you wear... You want me to remove yours? Yeah, you have to wear a helmet. Like, that's something that everyone does and everyone stands by. Everyone has lights on their bike. Safety, everyone stands by it. But reflectors in the rims, people will rip you apart. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I don't want to be a geek anymore. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Usually you're, you're pro. Oh yeah, but Jay, I got safety up the wazoo. Jay, I got so much safety features on my bike. Yeah, you want me to remove more safety features? You want me to remove the tires? No, I need those to go fast. Okay. Can we check the manual, see how much tire pressure they need? Uh, hold on. Next, we change the angle of the seat. And then we check if the key and battery lock have the same serial number before using it. Check the battery in the display. I need tire pressure, Mama. What does it say? Read oh. the sidewall of the tire. It, it doesn't say it in the manual? No, mm -mm. I don't know. It should say on the side of the tire, too. It should. Recommended pressure, 35 PSI. Yeah, so we'll go 33. Dot backwards, 72. Uh-huh. 
Is that a seven? So 34, turn on your little pressure jam. Brie loves this friggin' thing, by the way. Jay, there's a hole in your tire. What do you mean there's a hole in my tire? There's a hole in your tire. We didn't even touch back here. There's a hole in it. What the fuck you mean there's a hole? Show me. You'll see it. Jay, your tire is gonna blow out. Is Lance in here? No. 35. So we'll do 34 on both. What was the back one? What did you say? 35, 35 and 35? Yep. Brie, your ass is literally vagina. I have panties on. Yeah, no, that was just, that was, that was, that was pretty fucking cra crazy what that looked like. <laughs> that was some doggy style shit. Don't everybody get excited now. That was, that was all pussy, by the way. <laughs> I didn't know. Oh my goodness. Ain't nobody said nothing. <laughs> I was just like, yeah, it looks good. The, the bike. She's what? really good at bikes. Is there a bike in there somewhere? <laughs> no, yeah, there is. Yeah, there's a bike. <laughs> you just <laughs> I told you she's special, man. No one said nobody anything. Nobody said nothing because ain't nobody watching the fucking stream. Yo, it looked good, though. It did? Yeah, it was hot. Sweet. Turn on your pressure jam. Let's get it pumping. Oh, my goodness. All right, guys. He said he's screenshotting and he's putting it on the bike thread of Reddit. <laughs> Join. So first, you go into this closet and you open it up and you grab this guy. And this guy has this attachment. And you pull and pull and pull and pull. And pull and pull and pull and pull. And, pull. and then you pull some more. And then once you have enough slack, Use, you use this step stool to come up here. And then, oh, actually, since the garage door is open, we don't need the step stool. And we go like this. And now he's on. Good. Now, we come here and we grab this. This is for the tie. Is the air on? Not yet. That's the next step. We leave this on the floor. Then we come over here. We turn that all the way up. How much pounds we got in there? Was it 90. Set? Okay. And now it's ready to go. Go ahead. You like filming it, don't you? Yeah. See how much pussy you could put in the camera. It didn't go. What do you mean? It didn't make the boop boop. What do you mean? Oh, there we go. Oh, it's almost there. It's at 17 pounds. Oh, it is nowhere near. Do you want to tighten up these? This is all loose. I'm, I'm waiting until we have the tires. Oh. Wow, those tires are low. Beautiful. So the, the pounds of pressure in the tire is 15 pounds. Low. Yeah, that's really low. Really low. Couldn't that make your rim get bent in shipment? Good. Nope. 30, 29. There you go. <laughs> love that air compressor. I think so does Brie. I love it. It's it's fantastic. Uh, would 100% recommend anybody. So we got the step through. Let me bring this out a little bit. I here. had to get a, a an attachment for our air compressor. What do you mean? For my tire. Why? Because it's not, this is a Schrader valve. Road tires are Presta. Oh, see, that's 510. Look at my toes. So we want to go about right, right there. Wow, this is five, this is for someone, 
This is regular size, by the way, and I'm 6'1". So the fact that um, I am tippy-toeing it right now, um, that ain't right. That seat's got to come down. It, it Really? It looks like it should go up. Really? Yep. Did you see me? Yeah. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Sit on him. Here, here comes Bike Bree. Yeah. Troubleshooting Bree. I got you. What? Yee, I helped put together. Smaller size. My name is Bicycle Bree. Oh, Lance is in here. Is he? Says he's in here. He's in here in spirit. Is he? Hmm. Okay. I don't see him, but okay. All right. Yeah, that seat needs to come down. I don't give a shit what that says. I like it when my feet are flat. Okay. Do you want to put your shoes on? No. Do you want to put my shoes on? Well, that'll give you an accurate judgment. You'll give me an accurate judgment. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're leaving it like that? Like what? That low? Yo, do you see when I sit on it? Okay, I can tell you right off the jump, not super comfortable. Because either my ass is way too fat. We're going to put that big ass fluffy seat on there. Hold on. Stand up a little bit on this foot when you're on the bike. What do you want me to do? Stand up on the pedals, essentially. What? Nothing. Stand up on the pedals? Yeah. The fuck are you talking about? Well, because you see how, how long your leg is? Yeah. The other leg, so the seat should be like five inches higher. Five inches higher. First off, look at my butt. Your, Jay, my butt is barely on that seat. Yeah? Yeah. Ooh, I don't like this. What are you gonna say? What, I look funny? No. What you going, what you wanna say? Nothing. Say something. No. What do you wanna say? Nothing. Say something, you trying to say I look funny? No, the, I'm the bike just saying that your seat is way too low. Your, your knees are gonna hit your boobies. Knees are gonna hit my boobies? Move. <laughs> what you mean, knees are gonna hit my boobies? Why are they gonna hit my boobies? <laughs> I hope he hooked up the brakes. Why are they going to hit my boobies? Is it what? easy? Yeah. Nice. Why are they going to hit my boobies? I thought you had longer legs. No, look. I mean, I, I mean, I guess I could rate this seat. I can tell you right now. What I don't like is that seat. What's it, wrong with the seat? The seat, it just don't feel right. Why? Is it the angle? No, it's, it's my butt cheeks, yo. Jay, your butt will be fine. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Hold on. We're going to change. <laughs> Let's take the seat off of a $3,000 trek. Shh, shut up. <laughs> I don't think it's going to fit. Why not? All bikes are the same. Fuck you mean. There we go. Abington, looking good. Shows the battery life. Sport, turbo. So it is not a touch screen. A little upset about that. Oh wow, shows us our trip time. We got blinkers. Bree, you wanna show this or? Okay, or not? It has blinkers? So on the back side, we got our blinkers. That's our left. That's all right. Double tap it again. That shuts it off. 
If we press the brakes, lights up the brakes. Wow. Super sexy. That's nice. Our headlight in the front. For the battery, they're making a big deal about plugging the battery into that charge port before you put it in the wall. Uh, yeah, for short. Oh. And for the light, I'm sorry. There is an indicator. Why don't you plug that in? You will see that that is lighting up. <laughs> what do you do? You use the Q-tip, and on. then you throw it away. You use the Q-tip, and then you throw it away. You use the Q-tip, and then you throw it away. You use the Q-tip, and then you throw it away. <laughs> it's not. One more time. What do you do? <laughs> you use the Q-tip, and then you throw it away. Why do you get rid of it? You use the Q-tip, and then you throw it away. Why do you get rid of it? Why would you keep it? Because you're recycling. You use a Q-tip and yep. then you put it in your bra. You use a nice. Q-tip. I like it. <laughs> you put it in Perfect your bra. Perfect place for it. You use a Q-tip. There it is. And then you put it in your bra. There it is. There it is. All right, we're going to take out this garbage real quick. So that's the bike. I mean, all said and done. I Bree's going to have fun cutting this up. All said and done to put the whole bike together, it took what? I don't know, uh, 20 minutes. Uh, make sure your tires are filled up. It's, it's very easy to assemble putting your handlebars on, not difficult. Uh, giving it a ride, I have not ridden it. Um, your display is, you know, not, it's, it's not, you know. Is it worth the price that I paid for it? I don't know. I feel like anybody could put this together, honestly. Even Brie, you might have to read the manual, but not difficult. You know, I did get this bike for the purposes of working out, riding, and I'm not gonna give a million excuses as to why I don't ride it. Uh, bad knees, bad back, I don't know, start. So I figure that I will go from this and then graduate to this. Essentially, I want to put it on the ceiling somewhere, like one of the little hooks. You know what I'm talking about? Little, little C hooks. And then put it, I don't know, somewhere over here maybe. I don't know. I got to get it off of the floor and up because I don't want too many bikes here. And then Bree's getting a road bike, so she'll be retiring that guy. She says she's going to ride them both. I don't believe it. I think she's going to ride one over the other, but you think you're going to ride them both, Mama? Yeah. Yeah, you think so? Yeah. You pumped up for that road bike? Yeah. You want to bring this garbage out? Because there's some places where the road bike won't be able to go. Where's that? Oh, it's nice out here. On, like, the dirt trails. Okay. Nice spot. There it is on the app. It shows the battery percentage, the light, how much I love this. All of this sync cycling to health. Connected. You got your record. Bree is fucking terrible at the camera angle. Discover the little tab. That's nice. If you hit go. Three. Uh-oh. What? Uh-oh. Go where? I don't know. And there you go. All right. And we're going to stop that. Close that. There it is. So it does show a 24%. Now, oddly enough, what it's so what are you doing? Okay. Oddly enough, uh, to charge this, it says to plug in the plug in the charger first. And then plug it into the wall. It says do not do it the other way. Why? I have no idea, but it's in bold print, all in caps. So they're yelling at you. Is that really what it says? Yeah. That's a little inconvenient. So you have to do an extra step to do it. Right? Just unplug the back of that. Okay, or that. So you gotta, hold on. Go ahead. And we are charging. We are rocking and rolling. So pretty easy. Fred, did you adjust the light? What? Oh my goodness, let me help you, man. Oh. <laughs> Is the, and the bike's not very heavy either. It's, uh, it's fairly light. I don't know where the tool went. Did you take it away? <sighs> it's right here, Bray. Yeah, you, could, you could do something, right? This week on Cycling with Brie, we're going to... Cycling with tits? Cycling with tits, we're going to adjust the headlight and the bicycles. 
at the bicycles. <laughs> JC, I got lights on mine. Oh. But you know, the problem is with that light, Mama, is that's not pointed down. It's for safety. Yes. I understand. <laughs> I know what the purpose of it is. I can't make Look it point this. down. Look at this. What is this? That's good parts. What is it? Do you got that? Everybody's got that. <sighs> You're a nice bicycle. Okay, well that's off. And I'll tell you, riding a bike with uh... With uh... Oof. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I got it. Oh, this is a little peppy. Holy shit. This thing. Oh. oh, my. Oh, my. This, this thing moves. Brie, you want to try this? Oh, no, thank you. Oh, my God. That's on tour? I'm gonna go sport. This thing is moving, bro. I'll tell you what though, my ass, end of story. Uh-uh. This seat, I sit too, I sit too close to it. Okay. How is it? No joke. Okay, I don't know if this speedometer is off. Uh, but I tell you, turbo mode, I was going 28 miles per hour. <laughs> what? Yo, let me tell you this motherfucker moves. You want to try this, Brie? No. Yo, you got to try it. I can't. Why? Because I'm setting up for the new bike. Your bike is going to come soon. Yo, let me tell you this. <laughs> Yo, this is way too fast for a bicycle. You want to see me? There I am. Oh, he's... Okay, so, God, shit. You want to try it? There you go. Okay, so it's in, so once you hit this, as long as you hit the brake, this does nothing, okay? That's an eco mode, and you just kind of hit that, and it goes. How do you stop it? Brakes. Okay, so this is your, that's your rear, that's your front. Okay. It, 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 I'll tell you, it is, I don't know how anybody rides this. My ass. Look, she can fit on it fine. See, that's how, so you can pedal like a normal person or you can use the throttle. Okay, now go, now hit a full throttle and go straight. Now we're moving. Okay, that's, you're just going in a big circle. It's not a bad looking bike. That seat's not uncomfortable to you? This is Gucci. Oh my. Are you just gonna go in a circle and that's it? The difference between eco, regular. No, you're not going 100. She's ridiculous. Um, so I, I tell you, I don't know. It's got to be my ass. These seats are so uncomfortable. Um, she's saying the pedal assist is on. I don't. I either. I can't be that out of shape. Like I, I just don't. I don't feel the pedal assist at all. Um, it's fun. I get. I'll give it that. It's fun. Using the throttle, I could get to 20. I use my legs, I can get to 22.7. Shut the fuck up. Yeah. So you're saying you go faster? So, so I was just saying that I think the pedal assist, right, it doesn't have anything to do with how fast you go. It's a matter of how much you could take off as quick as possible with as little effort as possible. It's like if I just push down, that's not me. I'm not doing that. That's not me. So you're saying in eco mode. That seems comfortable for you. That's huge. And That's turbo, huge. it's super fast. Yeah. So all, all you need supported are your sit bones, which are down My up in there. My sit bones. <laughs> yeah, the rest of your butt being cushioned is just for fun. Yeah, well, I'll tell you what. My balls hurt from sitting on those. Try this without assist. Try it without assist? Yeah. Watch out. You got sweaty pussy on there. I do love some sweaty pussy. 
Go ahead, show your level of excitement. Show it off on camera. Let me get the camera angle changed. Hold on, she's excited. She's excited. Oh my God. Do you see how tiny this thing is? That's what you wanted though, right? Jay, look how light this is. I know, but that's what you wanted, isn't it? I hold this with one hand. Isn't that what you wanted? Yeah. It is pretty. Oh, golly, gee willikers. We forgot to tip him. That's okay. He was light, right? You don't deserve a tip. Wow, that is tiny. Isn't that what you wanted, though? That is really fucking tiny. Yeah, I could pick it up like this. Those brakes are sexy. No cables. All the cables are inside the hole. Yo, that's nice. It's not too small. There's plenty of room. Uh, I don't know, man. That is a tiny ass bike. This is this is way smaller than I expected. But isn't that what you wanted? Oh God. Oh, I don't want to hear shit, bro. 